Hi, my name is Victor and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be installing 3D shadow projector lights. Now when you open your door, I'm sure you guys have noticed that on the bottom here, there's a little light that shines onto the concrete. The 3D shadow light that I'm going to be installing, it's going to project the M logo onto the concrete, which makes it pretty cool. Let me go ahead and show you what comes in the box. I got these on Amazon for about $13, and this is what the box looks like. They do come in a pair. Now we open the box, you will get a set of two <clears throat> and a set of instructions. Now in this, can, in this little bag, these are what the projectors do look like. And these do fit right into the OEM location. And the kit also does bring if I can get them out. Little extension wires. These wires you will plug in to the stock um, female connectors with these two prongs and then this part you will connect it into the new projector lights. Now the only things that you will need to install these is a flathead. Now I didn't have one of the nice fancy plastic flatheads, so I just put a little bit of blue tape all over mine just to make sure that I don't scratch up my trim. Let's go ahead and start installing. All right guys, as you can see down here, this is the light that I was talking about right down here. And this is the one that we're gonna wanna take off. Now if you really look at it and pay attention, over here there's a little indentation on the driver's side door. This is the door that we're on. There's a little indentation right here where you can stick your screwdriver on the passenger side. It's going to be on the opposite side. So I'm going to go ahead, take my screwdriver, and carefully pull down, not to scratch anything, and it pops, up, pops out that easily. So then you're just going to take this out, pull it out gently. You see that clip right there? Just going to pull that right out. Probably be easier if I use two hands. There we go. This is what the factory one looks like. And here is the aftermarket projector that we're installing right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the added pigtail that they included because this is not gonna connect to the new one. Now you have to pay attention because even though this has four holes, there's only two wires connected to it as you guys can see right up here. So it's the two at the end. So that's where I'm gonna stick this in. And then you wanna take your projector light and plug in the other end. And right there we have it installed. Now, to put it back in, just push up the wires back into the hole. Slide this in. And push up. And as you guys can see, it is installed. Now let me go ahead and close the door and open it up so it can turn on. Now you guys probably cannot see this right now because it is not dark enough right now. But by putting it on my hand right here, I don't know if you guys can see, you can see that the M logo is pointing this way. I actually want it to, when I open the door, it's facing me. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this off again real quick. I'm gonna go ahead and pop this out. 
I'll just have to give it a little tug. Oop, I pulled out the whole thing. So I'm just gonna plug this in back here. As I said before, maybe you guys can see it a little bit more better here that the logo is smaller in my hand. It is pointing outward. I want it to point this way, so when I open the door, I see it and it greets me. This is a personal preference depending how you want it. This is kind of how I want it for me. So I'm just going to put this all back in here. And I'm going to go ahead and push that in. Now I'm going to go ahead and get some night shots for you guys while this is at night so you can see how nicely it does project. In the previous shot, I just showed you guys what the projector emblems look like at night. As you guys can tell, it looks amazing. I like that it's actually the M logo instead of the BMW logo, since a lot of people don't know what the M logo is. And also I think it just gives it a nice touch to your M vehicle. If you guys have any questions about installation or where to get the products from, go ahead and comment in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you guys next time.